Hello everyone, how are you doing? This is MD Tech here with another quick tutorial. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you how to exit safe mode on Windows 10 as well as Windows 8 if you're stuck in a boot loop. So you try and get into safe mode, you're able to get in. And unfortunately, you're unable to exit safe mode. In today's tutorial, I'm going to show you guys how to hopefully resolve that without too much of a hassle. So if you already opened up MS Config and made sure you selected normal startup from the option, that's the first thing I'd personally suggest. So if you're already in safe mode, go ahead and make sure you have your normal boot settings already configured. So if you restart your computer and you still end up in this safe mode boot, I would try booting into the troubleshooting menu or recovery options. So do a hard power off on your computer three times in a row or try and hold down the shift key on your keyboard while selecting restart. If you're able to get in the safe mode, open up the power button or click on the start menu icon I should say and then while Selecting restart, you want to hold down the shift key on your keyboard and that should hopefully again launch these options here. So we're going to select troubleshoot, reset your PC or see advanced options. We're going to select advanced options once more and now we're going to select the command prompt to use the command prompt for advanced troubleshooting. I'm going to select our user account here. And now you want to just go ahead and insert the password if you have one on your account. I don't actually have a password, so that's why it was blank in the field when I selected continue. So now you want to go type in exactly as it appears on my screen. I also probably will zoom it in. I might put up the text as well. I'm going to see how this all looks once I'm done recording, but I'm going to type in BCD edit, all one word as it appears on my screen, space, forward slash delete value. Delete value should all be one word. Again, attach to that forward slash out front. Another space. Then you want to do the curvy brackets. So it should be next to the P key on your keyboard. So I'm going to just left click on the shift key while holding on that key. It's like the ankle brackets basically except it has that little curve to it as you can see on my screen here. So again, it's the key next to the P key on a standard Western keyboard. And now you want to type in default in here. Then we're going to close the bracket. So again, just the key next to the Kirby bracket key. We're just going to do the shift and then that. Notice it's not angled off on the corners. It has that curvy appearance to it. Then you want to do a space and then type safe boot. Safe boot should all be one word here. So again, B C D E D I T space forward slash delete value so d e l e t e v a l u e followed by a space and then the curvy brackets default and we're going to close the curvy bracket and then another space and then safe boot all one word so s a f e b o o t hit enter on your keyboard so once you have a blinking cursor you want to just type exit here Hit enter on your keyboard and I would suggest continuing to your Windows installation and hopefully that should be about it. So as always, thank you guys for watching this brief tutorial. I hope I was able to help you out and I do look forward to catching you all in the next tutorial. Goodbye.